crispy. All right, welcome back everybody for another mini mate uh, setup video. Uh, this time breaking out uh, Spider-Man to take on Electro. Uh, originally had him in his electric suit, and then it just kind of didn't make sense that he's leaping out of the way while being uh, having elect electricity shot at him. Uh, but yeah, the you know swapped him out for black suit. Typically, I always use. Uh, you know, a variation of red and blue, uh, typically the 70s, 80s TV show, something like that, just classic Spider-Man. But uh, I, most of this is just getting Electro out, uh, too, and, you know, using those electric effects on him. Uh, and this is the first time I've ever done this, but over here we have uh, this electric effect as if he's draining uh, power from this downed uh, street light, which really makes sense for him, but uh, using some effects there. Uh, and then, of course, Spider-Man's up on the wood doll. Um, I have to get really down low. I actually have to turn my camera sideways just to hide the wood doll back there for his flight. Uh, but what ended up happening is I ended up with a lot of dead space in back and then just decided to throw Daredevil back there. And by the time I was done, I found a way to slip in uh, Frank Castle up there on top of this building, uh, watching everything go down. Uh, so yeah, just really turned out good. Uh, filling in that New York cityscape uh, is always a fun thing to do to give it that good New York, um, you know, metropolis feel. Uh, but yeah, turned out really good. Very pleased with it. Let's go on to the next shot. All right, so here we have uh, Punisher with a missile launcher uh, shooting it at Juggernaut. Uh, and I originally was going to do this with uh, Rhino and I just kind of thought, uh, you know, can Rhino actually take a, uh, you know, a shoulder fire missile launcher, RPG, whatever they call it, uh, you know, shoulder fire missile? I don't know if uh, Rhino can. So I figured I would use uh, Juggernaut because he's always been another, uh, you know, Spider-Man villain. Not not one of the big ones, but he has been known to be in there. I think everybody's just kind of in Spider-Man uh, comics, but... Juggernaut's made more than a few appearances, so, uh, but yeah, and then having uh, Punisher with that missile launcher from uh, Nick Fury from the first Avengers movie, standing on a car, shooting it at Juggernaut, trying to save Spider-Man, and then I threw in uh, one of the battle-damaged Spider-Mans, just because uh, he's the first one I came across in the, the uh, my red and blue bin of uh, Spider-Man figures. So, uh, and then these blast effects are are tacked on the back end or whatever. And I did take a laser pointer. You know, if you look at that picture that I showed at the beginning, it's it is kind of lit up. It looks pretty cool. A little little bit extra to this shot. So, uh, but otherwise, let's go on to another shot. All right. So yeah, last shot. Uh, I just bought this Ben Riley. I always thought I had him. Uh, you know, on the right-hand side, on, and that uh, that is actually, man, the Clone War, the Clone Saga is so confusing. I think at this point in time, the whole backstory is Spider-Man fights his clone, the clone falls down a chimney and dies, uh, he escapes, and then becomes Ben Riley. he never actually dies, it's like a skeleton or something, then he becomes Ben Riley, the Scarlet Spider. And then after a while, something happens where you find out the Scarlet Spider was actually uh, the original Peter Parker at Peter Parker. <laughs> and then, you know, I, he was a clone the whole, all those years. A lot of people are upset. Uh, but this is kind of a throwback to that, um, you know, storyline. We, we have Mysterio doing his thing. Like, you know, he's playing mind games. But we have the the uh, dead Spider-Man that's coming out of the smokestack, uh, which was Ben Riley. Uh, you know, I can't remember if he's the one who faked his death or the Jackal faked his death or how all that worked out. But uh, the Spider Clone, the original Spider Clone, which is also Ben Riley on the right hand side, as far as I can remember, uh, is actually Spider. I don't remember. Oh my God, I'm so confused right now. <laughs> anyways guys uh yeah that's basically all this is getting that polyester fuzz up quick so when you focus on the characters themselves it gets nice and blurry 
Um, the closer you can get, come on, focus on Spider-Man. Focus on him. All right, let's try zombie. There we go. Okay. And the closer you get up to that, the more it, it, it uh, the better it looks, I should say. So are you going to focus on Spider-Man? No, you are not going to. There we go. Yeah, the better that, that small cut right in front uh, looks. But yeah, just kind of hiding Mysterio and back to where Spider-Man wouldn't notice him. Uh, and yeah, that's about it. And then filling in the background with uh, some buildings and stuff. So uh, anyways, guys, that's it for this video. Uh, hit the like and subscribe button. Check out the description of the video for my Instagram and Facebook page. We'll see you at the next video. Bye now.